Jamaica Football Federation General Secretary Dennis Chung has sought to clar clarify uh, the saga surrounding Leon Bailey's absence from the Copa America squad. On Wednesday, in a live broadcast on CVM TV, the GFF released a 26 member squad. The squad included the Phoenix Academy, Leon Bailey, and Dijon Whisper Richards players. But immediately after, Reggae Boys head coach Heimer Halgrimson said Whisper was not available due to injury. Head of Phoenix Academy Craig Butler then revealed on Instagram that Bailey was not available as he's focusing on his mental health, while Bailey tweeted, misleading information. However, speaking on Sports Explosion on Hits 92 FM with Oral Tracy on Thursday, JFF General Secretary Dennis Chung revealed that as part of Leon Bailey's inclusion, Butler wanted another player to be included in the under-20 reggae boys squad, among other things. I called him the, the evening and I said, listen, um, did you talk to the coach? Have you decided what you want to do? And said to me, well, did you talk to them about this other player, this under-20 player? I said, what does have to do with it? I said, the things are totally related, mm. unrelated. He said, well, if, if that person is not in it, then I can't talk to Leon. Right? I said, well, listen, you know what you do? I said, you decide if you want him in the team or not. I said, if him come, him come. I said, if him don't come, him don't come. I said, well, that's a conversation you have with the coach. I said, don't ask me about any selection of any player. And I left it there. And then Craig called me also. And he said, boy, I just talked to the coach. I just want to get some assurances about something. And he made it three things. Okay? He said, first, um, the coach told him that um, a lot of the players will have their own room. I said, yes, that's a conversation I had with him because he said that they'll be there for a long time. So some of the players don't mind sharing, but some of the players don't want them to have their own room. So I said, yeah, that's, that's fine. Uh, the second thing he said to me, he said, well, what about security for Bailey? I said, well, um, as far as I know, Comic Ball will provide a security officer. And I said, Bailey wants he can carry his personal security. Right? I said, um, but we can't provide individual security for, for each player. Right? And he said, well, what happens when a, a, a reporter pushes a mic in his face? I said, that's an arrangement for the management team to make in terms of access to players. 